Okay, now that we've done our titration, it is time to clean up. Your instructor will give you specific directions of how to handle the waste that is generated during the experiment. In our case, we're going to use this waste beaker to contain the waste. First, pour the contents of the flask inside the waste beaker. Also pour the excess titron, which is inside this burette, into the waste beaker. Now, we are ready to clean the burette. To do this, we're going to stand by the sink, use deionized water, and pour a few milliliters inside the burette. Then flip the burette horizontal and rotate it such that it rinses off all the inner surfaces of the burette. Then bring the burette back to the vertical position, open the stop cork, and drain the washings into the waste container. If you notice any particulate matter inside the burette, it is best to use the burette brush to remove all the particulate matter. Repeat this process about two to three more times to ensure that the burette is completely clean. Once this is done, we're going to walk to the bench to clamp the burette upside down to ensure that it's dry and ready for the next lab experiment.